Hey guys, uh, this is Joe from uh, Joe Tech PC Services, and I'm going to show you something that um, I think needs to be shown because I think it's really cool. Um, this fan is from a, um, I believe, a 9800 GT uh, video card. I completely dismantled the uh, the heatsink and fan, took everything off of it. And uh, now I'm, I just have this fan. This fan makes a lot of noise. It's not seized, but this is also a way how to fix a seized fan. Um, this is a blower for that. Uh, it still spins, but it gets stuck every so often. It just did. So this this fan this fan or blower has an issue. So I'm going to show you how to fix this. It makes a lot of noise when it spins. It goes, it makes a ton of noise. So we don't want that. So I'm going to show you how you can fix this. Most most fans that you buy for really low cost are um, bushing. They don't have bull bearings on them. So um, that's one of the negative things about some of the fans that don't have any lubrication. But you know what? We're going to fix that. So you take apart your your device or fan or whatever you have a fan even if you have a regular box fan hang on I'll show you that so you could do the same thing with a box fan too just say this was seized you would do the exact same thing I'm going to show you in a moment uh, but this one is perfectly fine there's no issues with this fan whatsoever so okay take a small screwdriver and you peel the sticker off carefully If unless you don't care, but sometimes it's it's hard to get off. And there we go. This actually, you know what? This one doesn't have any sticky left at all, so we'll have to reseal this. So we'll peel this off completely. All right. So now we have. If you look carefully, there is that. That is the. Um, the bearing or well, the bushing. This happens to be a bull bearing, which is right there. Let me bring it up a little closer to you so you can see. Okay, so we want, we want, we're really interested in this, but we don't want to get oil everywhere else. So, what we're going to do is we're going to lubricate this. So, what I have, I have a little cup full of machine oil or actually engine oil for a car. And I have a, I have a, um, which I'm gonna call it a uh, paper clip. And what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna dab the paper clip in here, and there'll be like a little ball of oil on the tip, and I'm gonna drop it right on top of that. I'm gonna continue doing that a couple of times to make sure that the oil is gonna be going to lubricate the bad fan and once that is full oh there we go it finally you see it go all the way around it finally went around a couple more times we're going to put it in here oil doesn't evaporate however WD-40 does so that's a quick fix okay so it looks like I filled it all the way up so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a piece of a black electrical tape. I'm going to cover that up. Just give me a second. I'm trying to get the electrical tape out of here. There we go. And then we're going to cover it. Okay, it's sealed. So now you don't want the oil to come out. So, I mean, I can't power it on, but I'm hoping that that noise will go away. It makes a lot of noise when this thing powers on. But I, I, I can already see already that it's much more, you can probably hear the noise. It'll probably take a couple of times for that to actually really wear in and uh, won't make any more rough noise. But that's how you repair a seized fan. 
Now, if the fan is still seized, when you oil it up, um, when you spin it a couple of times manually, like I did, like this, um, it'll 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 start to break free a little bit. And as soon as you put it in the computer, back in the computer, it'll probably take about five ten minutes to actually finally work through all the inter all the bearing or the bushings, if it's bushings and if it's bearings, to go through and through the entire shaft. And once that's done, you'll you probably would hear the fan uh, crank up in speed, especially if it's a video card fan. So if you have a small little video card fan such as this in your computer and, and your computer is, the display is like shutting off and the computer appears to be shutting down, most likely it's a seized fan or the fan is covered in so much dust that um, it can't um, spin any longer. But don't fret, you don't have to throw the video card away. Just do this simple little fix. And uh, you'll be A-OK. -okay. You'll be back in business again. So um, anyway, take care. Hope everything is great. And this is a great way to revive your fans because the motor itself doesn't really die because these are brushless. So there's nothing for this thing to actually die inside. You're not burning anything up. If anything, it's just current being sent to the motor, but nothing happens. Nothing, nothing dies in the fan itself. So the fan's always in good shape, even if it sits there for days and days and days sitting there doing nothing. So... This is a great way to revive your fan. Take care.